Hello my friends, in this video I shall be explaining you about the impact of Jupiter transit in the Taurus zodiac which is going to happen on 1st May 2024 for the Pisces ascendant people. Right, as we all know at present Jupiter is in the Aries zodiac, Aries Rashi and the Nakshatra is the Bharani. So if we go on to, right, if we go on to 1st of May. So, Jupiter has entered into Taurus on 1st of May 2024, right? So, the star is, the nakshatra stands as Kritika. The star lord stands as Sun because Kritika is ruled by Sun. And as I always say, planet alone cannot give results. It needs star lord to give its result. That's why we cannot ignore the star lord while predicting for any event this is for the transit rest the total predictions will be based on your personal mahadasha antardasha and pratyantardasha which totally depends on your personal horoscope because every person is unique every person so the transit will not have the same impact on each and every person because all planets are differently placed in different horoscopes right are you i hope you are getting what i am exactly i am trying to say so this is for the transit like jupiter will be giving the results of sun when it enters into taurus and if we go on to pisces ascendant so if i talk about the pisces ascendant people in the pisces ascendant jupiter is really important can you tell me why because it is the lagna lord getting my point the Lagna Lord when enters into the Taurus like so if we talk about Pisces so Jupiter will be entering into the third house okay so 10th Lord and the first Lord enters into the third house third house is what marketing from all the ends marketing is being signified sales self efforts siblings right mental power so in front of jupiter we will write one because pisces is in the first house we write three why three why third house because it will enter taurus and taurus is in the third house what my point and 10th. Why 10th? Because Sagittarius is also being ruled by Jupiter. So it's 10th. Right? So 1, 3, 10. And if I talk about the first Lord placement is in the third house. So this person is very much attached to his younger siblings. Maybe during this time you will get attached to your younger siblings. So you might, you might uh, be traveling a lot. Like there might be a lo lot of short travels during this period. And person has got a strong mental development. Maybe you have a great mental development during this period. Because Lagna Lord is in the third house. Third house rules mental power. Right. Individual will be always be having the plans to do something new or to begin something new. But that totally depends on the, on the condition of the fifth house and the fifth Lord. So you mean to say that you might be having a lot of plans. You might be good at planning. Right. But the execution depends on your moon. So moon is actually the fifth lord. Right. And plus we also have to see what exactly what planet is there in the fifth house also for the Pisces ascendant I am talking about. Okay. So one more one tip for you is that you need to be emotionally strong. Why I am saying this? Because your emotions can hold your hold you back. Emotions can hold you back. And in this way you won't be able to execute whatever you have planned. Are you getting my point? Because you will be full of planning. Since Lagna Lord is in the third house so you will be full of planning 
बट फॉर डैट यू नीड टू बी इमोशनली स्ट्रॉन्ग सो प्लीज कंट्रोल योर इमोशन इट्स अ टिप फॉर यू कंट्रोल योर इमोशंस एल्स इट विल होल्ड यू बैक सो दिस वॉज फॉर एक्चुअली फर्स्ट लॉर्ड इन द थर्ड हाउस इफ आई टॉक अबाउट द टेंथ लॉर्ड प्लेसमेंट इन द थर्ड हाउस so the person should be choosing his own business rather than doing a job maybe you are in a job and you might think of ch- giving up your job and starting your own business reason for that is that third house stands for self effort and a person can do a lot of hard work for his own career growth 10th house is the house of career third house is the house of self efforts so you might be putting lot of self efforts you might be working very hard to uh, to excel in your own career like in your own business getting my point so you, there might be a chance that you might enter into any franchise business actually third house is the agency so agency business or any a franchise business you might think of opening that getting it so you can and you can also go for a career re- related to media marketing tour and travels social media is also very essential uh, nowadays we all know that social media is very essential tool for any business and we see many job profiles falling under this category like we have social media marketing we have seo right we have ppc etc so you might be entering into this field for the job or like you might be opening up your own digital marketing agency getting my point so jupiter can really give you these many things franchise business agency business sales and marketing etc so your writing may bring you good name and fame and it's a bet, better thing to start your career away from your birthplace see you can also enter into writings if you write it's a best time to write it again write a book start a blog and if possible go away from your birthplace if possible because third house is what third house is 12th from 4th getting my point fourth house is own place fourth house is own home third house is away from home why because third is 12th from 4th so if you want to set up your career away from your birthplace after 1st may 2024 is best time get my point so this was for this was for the first lord and the 10th lord in that third house now we are forgetting something yes we cannot forget role of sun so jupiter is and sun jupiter is what 1 3 10 sun rules leo leo falls in this sixth house and where is sun where is sun sun is in sun is in come on sun is in aries only aries first may aries till the time it is in aries so aries falls in the second house okay so 1 3 10 2 6 it's 1 3 10 2 & 6 do you know what this 2 6 10 indicates 2 6 10 indicates huge wealth a good career this 3 6 good for social media good for news channels media writing long story short this is one of the best test period for pisces ascendant people if your mahadasha antra dasha and pratyantra pratyantra dasha are also favoring you these houses like 2 6 10 3 then 
just note down my words you gonna rock this will be the golden period for you people for pisces ascendant i am saying it mark my words because transit is really favoring for you really favorable for you it is represented representing very very good houses because we cannot forget star lord star lord is the utmost uh, star lord is of utmost importance 1 3 10 2 6 one of the best yog for wealth little bit 1 and 6 little bit illness little bit illness is visible but not to worry about that thing right please subscribe my channel if you have liked my video please like my video please share it so that i can bring you these type of videos to your feed and there won't be a problem for you to go to another astrologers or to pay them because i am explaining each and everything in a detailed manner that to free of course not charging anything just want your support just want your subscribe button that's it i'll be uploading many videos like this more very soon thank you so much